This tutorial is going to show you how to create a M&M um, &M Paris style piece of topography using clipping masks in Photoshop. So you're going to need to have an image of a face or your own face um, to start with um, and then open that up in Photoshop. So just drag it into Photoshop and open it up. Um, and then if you've got a colour image like I have um, and you need to make it kind of black and white like um, this image, we're just going to quickly go through those steps. So if you go into image, adjustments and desaturate, that will just change your image so it's in black and white. And then we're just going to make some further adjustments. So we're going to adjust the brightness and contrast. So that's image adjustments, brightness and contrast. And whack the contrast right up to 100. Um, and then just kind of adjust the brightness as you need to for your particular image. It's going to depend on um, how your particular image looks. And when you're happy with how it looks, just kind of click OK. And then just a final step to make it completely black and white. Um, image adjustments and threshold and you'll see it straight away changes into a completely black and white image and then you just want to get a nice balance of black and white so you don't want too much but you need enough to kind of see some of that extra detail so I'm going to leave mine around there and just click OK. So now we're ready to add our text layer and um, so the first thing you need to do is unlock this image layer so that you can work on it so if you double click on the padlock and just click OK and then go into layer, new layer, and this is going to be our text layer. And then if you click on the text tool down here, and then make sure you've got a nice bold font, um, and also quite a large font size, because we need it to take up quite a lot of the image, so I've gone for 800, which is quite massive. Um, and then just type the letter that you want, so I'm going to just use my initial, which is C. Um, and then just kind of drag and place that somewhere on your image. Um, and then you'll see on this m, &M Paris image, there's some little like just bits um, that are a little bit extra. So we can kind of add some of those using the shape tool. So I'm just going to use the ellipse tool. And um, you see this little um, no entry kind of looking sign. If you just click on your image and then rasterize the type layer, just click OK then you'll be able to use that. And I'm just going to drag and just have these little kind of little bits coming off of my C shape as well, just as an extra thing. So you don't have to do that, but it might just add a little bit of extra detail that will look quite good. So once you're happy with that, if you just drag that text layer underneath your image layer, it will disappear for now, but it, you'll see it again in a minute. Then click back onto your image layer, hold down control, and click again, and then you'll see these different layer options, and we're just going to click Create Clipping Mask. And then you'll see all we've got now is your um, image in the shape of your word. Something we might want to do, because I've got quite a lot of white on my image, is just drag your image around so that you've got some black outlines going around um, these edge bits, because otherwise we might lose those a little bit in a second. Um, so I'm just going to drag mine to around there. And um, once you're happy with it, if you then select both layers and just click right click, so again holding down control to do that, and click flatten image, and you'll see we're left with this um, letter C here. And then just to kind of add some final little details, again we're just going to unlock that layer so that we can work on it. You can just use the brush tool um, to just add some little drippy effects. So I've got um, one of these sort of brushes, but you can just play around and use, um, just have a little play around and um, add diff different details in different places. So some little, nice little drippy sort of sections. Um, if you do something, so if I did this and I don't want it there, if you just hold down Command and then hit Z, that will just get rid of it. Um, so you don't need to add too much because there's not too many of those little bits on um, those images, but just a couple of nice ones. I might just add a nice little bit of extra um, to it. Yeah. And that's it. That's how you create a M&M Paris style um, bit of topography in Photoshop.